Okay, my name is Erin Dion, and my most recent novel is called Notes from an Accidental Band Geek. It came out in um, 2011. Notes is about a uh, freshman in high school. Her name is Elsie Wyatt, and she is a musical prodigy. Um, she plays the French horn, and she wants to be in the Boston Symphony. Except, um, and to do that, she needs to work really hard, and she has this whole plan that she wants to follow about going to this super special summer music camp. Um, but things kind of get thrown when she ends up having to be in her high school marching band. She has to learn a completely new instrument. She has to learn how to march. And Elsie's not so great at making friends. Um, and so she has to kind of learn how to work as part of a team um, and kind of deal with all the hijinks that go on in a not so super serious organization. So it's humor and chaos and music and a lot of fun. Um, for me, that, that age group kind of resonates with me as a writer. I think my work that's been the most successful and authentic in terms of voice and character comes from those teen years. For me, it's really hard to write about being an adult. I don't think I really have a handle on adulthood yet, <laughs> sad as that may be, but I have a really good handle on like junior high and early high school. <laughs> so those issues, I think, are um, you know, exciting for me to write about. I feel like there's a lot of stories to tell at that time, and the voice and the character is a lot more authentic for me. I think probably because there's so many opportunities to tell great stories, and everybody loves a great story, regardless of how old the character is, or what their situation is, or, um, you know, and I think that obviously everybody goes through adolescence and can relate to some of the struggles that these characters have faced. So um, it seems to me kind of like natural that there would be kind of a gravitational pull towards these great characters and great stories from great writers. The least favorite? Actually, I wrote a book when I was here at Emerson um, for my uh, thesis that will probably never see the light of day. <laughs> and um, it's kind of dark and sad and not funny, which is not what I write now. I'm kind of a, I'm a humorous writer. Um, and so for me, I call it my learning novel. Um, so it'll never, it'll never be published. It'll be in a drawer forever, and you'll never get to see it. <laughs> Fair enough. Thank you.